following video showcases the views and opinions of young adults from the age group of 9 to 18 years. This is an attempt to get students to speak about issues that are close to their heart. Watch and get a glimpse of what the future of India is thinking and where is India's youth headed. Viewers are requested to consider the students age before judging and voting. Last month at my brother's engagement, I met my distinct relative Mr. Patil. While talking to him, our subject changed to education. He said, you must be doing some business management courses after 12th, right? I asked him why. His answer was shocking. He said, your father owns a business and he can offer you a job after your 12th. I said, what after 12th? He said, just do some business management courses and he will give you a job. I got his sarcastic tone. Not only he, but few more people asked me about my future plans. And rather than asking, they concluded that I must be doing some business management courses after 12th. And the reason? Only because I am son of a businessman who owns a large agro-based company. Hello everyone, I am Prabhat Shinde and I am here to give a talk on nepotism. And this was what I face in every family function or friends get together. Are they the ones who are going to decide what I am going to do in future? The thing that I would become director of a company owned by my father without any efforts only because I am his son. Nepotism. I can hire a person to do the job which they, sh uh, they think I should do. But if I become the director, a person who is more deserving than me will lose the job. And most important, am I going to handle the job as efficiently as my father does? Certainly not. I don't have any knowledge of it. There was a case in UP where 250 doctorates, 2500 postgraduates and almost 1.5 lakh graduates appeared for a job interview which for a post of pure. The doctorates are giving interviews for a post of pure. So this is the condition of today's employment structure. And here my relatives want that I should become director of a company when I am still in standard 11th. Even Azim Premji did not allow his son to become head of the company because he said, I can't trust him until he is capable of holding the position. If I become director, I think I will hire all my friends and will have grand parties in office until my father comes in, stops the music and slaps me too hard just to stop all what we were doing. So in India, so called democratic country India, you don't need a degree for getting a job. All you need is a friend or a father who owns a big business and can hire you. You need degree just for marriage. Don't forget to like and subscribe. This video is brought to you by Suyojit Viridian Valleys.